Hey, my name is Ben Johnson. I'm the CTO of Obsidian Security. We started Obsidian because, first of all, we wanted to create a great company. But secondly, we chose to focus on a problem that we felt was not being addressed. And that is, as more and more companies move critical applications, business processes, and data to the cloud, there's virtually no solution out there that gives security operations teams detection and response for those applications. So if you ask a team, what can they do when it comes to detecting adversarial you know, account compromise or insider threat in their SaaS applications, they often say, I have no capability. And then similarly, teams want to be able to investigate, triage, and clean up when there's an issue. And often they don't have the data. They don't have the access. They don't have the data. They really just don't have the telemetry. And so what we've done is we've gone in and built very rich, very deep integrations with leading SaaS applications. We pull the right data, which is a combination of behavioral event data, as well as the enumeration and inventory of users, roles, privileges, configurations. Then we map all those together through a graph, which not only ties users to their behavior and their privileges, but also looks at an identity across multiple applications. In our product, we present high priority alerts as action items, so it's easy to figure out what to do. We also enable the user to have a list of improvements and hygiene uh, areas that they should focus on. Now, within the product, there's also a lot of dashboards, different ways of looking at the data, like failed logins and you know, what are my privileged users doing? From an alert perspective, there's alerts across services, whether they're ML-based, rule-based, or customer-driven. And from a telemetry perspective, we pull it all together in an incredibly easy-to-use uh, fashion for incident response. Now, from an identity-centric perspective, you get to see all the accounts your users have, how much they're using those accounts, what privileges are they granted, and then all the activity that that particular user performed over that time period. Finally, we pull together all of these accounts and show you which ones are inactive so you can deprovision them safely. What we've done is really build this platform that is giving teams the ability to detect threats, respond to them, and then also look for hygiene issues, hygiene problems. Where do people not have MFA? Where are accounts uh, enabled but maybe are just idle and should be deprovisioned? So that's what we've done here at Obsidian.